Yo, what is good, YouTube? I'm about to say some, some BS, okay? Um, but honestly, not. So how's my video al already published? What? I just uploaded that. Holy crap! Yo, go sub. I mean, go watch. Um, okay, so this is gonna be a trading concept that I literally don't think people have ever talked about. In fact, I'll take this as my concept. It can be called. The Savex, um, the Savex, um, freaking tr trend analyzer. Okay, I like that. Fudge! Oh, it's because my X is messed up. My bad, guys. Okay, my fault. Okay. Holy smokes! Ooh, trend. Predictor. No, 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 no. Ooh, future. Trend futures. Oh! No, trend. Save X. Trend and up. I like that. Analyzer. I don't know if I spelled that right. Save X trend analyzer. STA. I like that. Alright, so. What this is, is it's, bro, it's such a simple concept, okay? So, whenever you see price, say you're in a long position, right? Okay, and um, you enter long just based on some some reasons. You enter long right here, expect the price to go up there. Now, hear me out. Hear me out. You expect price to go like this, right? Or maybe like this. But instead, this is what you get. Okay. Boom. This is where I come in. Okay. This is my theory. Okay. Okay. From the point where you entered, okay, no, odds are you're going to get stopped out from here. It's literally a 50-50 chance at this point, because you're, you're, um, freaking, your analysis of the, your analysis of the market wasn't strong enough to predict price, okay? Because right now, you did not predict price to go up here. You did not, I guarantee you didn't predict this to happen before price goes up there. You might have been like, okay, price will probably go up here, maybe reject off this, maybe form a BPR, and then push back up, okay? So, where the uh, Savex trend analyzer comes in is it will measure the angle with the info line of the trend, okay? Call me crazy. Also, I have the trend calibration calibrator, um, which is, you know, that's a good name as well. I like this one more, though, okay? Actually, they're both good. Um, anyways, though. You draw it from where you entered to where price is now. And if it exceeds 40%, you stay in the trade, okay? I might change it to 45 But this can be taken advantage of, okay? Because right now, we are at 48%. But if we squeeze out, you can see the number change. So you want your, this to be where you normally would take the trade. And you pretty much got anywhere between 40% and, you know, the, the higher up, the better. You know, but uh, anywhere between 40% and up, okay? So, like, right here is fine. But if price is moving at this angle, nah, okay? So, what this is doing is it's seeing if your analysis of the market was accurate. Because if it is, price should move to your take profit. But if not, it won't. Alright, now, I just, I don't even incorporate this in my trading. But I thought I'd put it out there as a concept because low-key I do see potential in this. I 100% see potential in this idea of, you know, the angle of the markets. Because that's not even crazy to say that, to be honest. Like, that's not even crazy to say that. Because if we look here, okay, the trend calibration calibrator. Bro, this trade I took was literally freaking 80 degrees, okay? Now, if we look here, if I would have traded off this SMT, which I should have. I'm looking at 50 degrees, which is still good, above 40. But now, if say I enter a trade here, and I see prices like right here, I'd be like, oh, 20 degrees, are you kidding me? Right here, 30 degrees, no, I'm out of that trade, okay? But, so I see price going up, I'm like, okay, 60 degrees, nice, 40 degrees, okay, if price dips any lower than this, I'll probably exit. And as you can see, literally right here, it does, and what does it do after that? It tanks. I mean, kind of tanks, not really, it's just kind of goes down a little bit farther but then it tanks okay kind of like it's, it's just not gonna go up it'll probably continue down to be honest um but yeah so that's the idea 
I definitely do see potential in this, but you just can't abuse it. Like, if you do something like this, bro, if you can just say the market's always a, you know, you took a 76 degree trade, when the truth is you took a, you know, a 60 degree trade, okay? So I do see potential in this idea. This is a weird video. Um, I don't even know if I'm going to post this, but I, I, I truly see potential. Because if you do predict the market, you know, it should actually go to your take profit. It should go to the draw and liquidity you're targeting. But if you don't, it'll just not go to that. It'll just kind of chill around. So, yeah. Uh, yeah.